it's still heavy. Now here we are, another another day, another hot, humid morning. So it's about 90 degrees now. It's uh, 11 o'clock, and uh, according to my gizmo on the wall, it's a 75% relative humidity. Uh, it's so bad in here that the sweat is uh, sweating. So my mini mill really doesn't like it when it gets this hot, and uh, I do all the things I can do to not make it seize up. And one of the things I'm doing here, cutting out that throat, <clears throat> this is the rough cut, uh, and I'm using a half inch drill. So I'm just punching down but sharing the hole behind it. The reason why I'm doing that is that allows the shavings a place to escape. Otherwise, if you were just drilling a hole, 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 uh, it might bind up and you'd end up having to you know, keep cleaning it out. So. Let's, uh, this should be the last one, so I thought I'd just bring you guys up to speed. Yeah, a little cutting fluid there, and we'll see what happens. If we can cut this thing, we'll all be cut the roots now. Are you ready? Here we go. My drill speed may be a little high. I already hear the uh, bucking of the motor. This is going to be the last thing I was going to do with it today. It's just getting so hot out here. Uh, looking at the gauge, we got two inches to go here. So I think I'll just flip the video and get back to the end. Okay, about ready to kick it off. There it goes. Cutthroats. I bet this sucker's hot too. Ooh, yeah. All right. It's still heavy. Oh, it with aluminum, it wouldn't be that heavy. All right. So the next stop is put my end mill back on and go back here and smooth that stuff out. Try to bring her in spec for 4150. Thanks for watching.